southern Louisiana, a sportsman's paradise, where there's no shortage of water, shoreline, and redfish. A lot of redfish. On this trip, Captain Jonathan Moss joins Captain Max McKinley for a Cajun rendezvous. So sit back and see how it all unfolds as we flip through the pages of the Captain's Log. Man, water is low this morning, it's chilly. Oh yeah. Last time I was here, we were fishing against each other in a tournament. <laughs> <laughs> this, today, we teammates, brother. We're partners in the water today. Oh eh? yeah, man, I've been looking forward to it, man. Water's low, but it's it seems like it's slicked out. It seems like we're gonna it's, get it's, some sun. So. Yeah, these clouds are burning off fast. It's oh, gonna yeah. be a beautiful day. Yes, sir. Let's go stick some fish, homie. Heck yeah, dude. Yes, sir. Yeah. Pretty skinny water, the sun's not really up too high yet. So we're kind of just gonna be tilting our head into the sun to try to get that maximum sight, you know what I mean? Yep, absolutely. And in this color water, at this time of day, you're not really gonna see like a big bright fish or any really color. You're just gonna see a dark back. Dark it's back, just gonna be sitting on that, sli on yeah, that bottom, exactly. sliding around. Exactly, so. Super skinny, so try to just make your presentation with the spoon a little subtle. Lead them by a few feet. Don't even need to reel too much, probably. Just jig it a couple times on the bottom. You should should come whack it. There he is. Oh, got him. Uh, you know, we, I was casting further out in this trough, and I said, you know, we have drifted some. Yeah. I'm gonna throw it in sh closer. Yep. Yes, sir. And sure enough, Got whack. He feels like a good fish too, man. Good stuff. Yeah, man. Thinking about that sun being up higher, it's been a couple hours since sunrise. We literally just got started. And uh Yep, they're warming that up. Shallow water is gonna warm up faster. Exactly. Nice fish. Good fish, good fish. Probably gonna take you under here, be ready. He's all white from being up on that sand. Oh yeah, right under. Yep. yep I got it. <laughs> it's called doing the dance. We're gonna run it back out in the Gulf of Mexico. <laughs> oh, brother! Nice, man. Good stuff. Let me know when you're ready, fish. I'll turn you. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, baby girl. Come on back. Oh, yeah. Good fish, man. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking 32. Easy. Nice fish, man. Super healthy. All right, I'm gonna slide her on this side of the boat. Hey! Nice, buddy. <laughs> Good work. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, listen, that, you know. Look how fat she is. She is fatter and thicker than she is long, oh, man. Yeah. That is a. Look at the stomach. Dot of a redfish. <laughs> That's a pretty one right there. It's a great redfish. This bait, man. fish has got some shoulders, bro. Oh, yeah. And super clean, being up on that sand. Mm -hmm. Blue in the tail. Getting ready to spawn or something. Yes, got sir. A little, got a little funky thing going on there. Let's uh, let's get her unbuttoned. If you could yes, do sir. that for me, and then I'll get her back in the water. There we go. Awesome. If you could grab that rod for yes, me. Yes, sir. Go Thanks, ahead and bro. release her. All right, bro. Let me get this thing in the water before we drift up on the beach. Come here, girl. Oh, oh, here she oh, goes. She's ready. She's ready. See ya. Go! Yes, sir. Hey, number uno. Heck yeah. Let's get, get back to business. Let's get back to work. Ow. There he is. <laughs> is there that song, brother? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> he didn't come up and hit it hard, and I was like, well, I, I, I hit him, and then he realized, wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That thing bit back. <laughs> That's funny. Yes, sir. Good deal. It's a good deal. Another good one, brother. Another good fish. They're all good. They're all good. Oh, but. they're all good, but they're especially sweet on a after hour plus cold, cold boat ride. <laughs> <laughs> Makes it all worth it. Man, we were bundled up like we were going skiing or something. Hell yeah. That might be the smallest one I've ever caught out here. Which is, I mean, hey, it's a, it's, you get a trophy for that. Fresh out the oven right there. He's hooked in the side of the mouth. That's why he was pulling weird, like, oh. like he was bigger. <laughs> he came up and thumped it, but he didn't get it in his mouth. Oh, he's cold. Da -da -da. You want him? No, nah, go ahead and do the honors for me. Get him back in the water. Cool, cool. Very good. All right, it's a fish. Keep it up. Yes, sir. Get another. More to be caught over there. Oh, yeah. The Captain's Log with Captain Jonathan Moss, presented by Softwash Systems, is being brought to you by Softwash Systems, build your dream. Florida Fishing Products, fish better, fish Florida. Icon Coolers, cool for life. Danko Pliers, the largest selection on the planet. DOA Lures, the unfair advantage. East Cape Boats, and go cast away fishing charters. Okay, I see him floating in the uh, on the surface at your one. Yeah, right in that direction. Just bomb one. It's that same dark spot you were casting at before. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much right there. Actually, halfway in between where you just cast it and us, there's. Okay, there's a good amount of fish in here. Got him. Got him? Yep. yep. That's literally the one I was looking at. There's a couple with them. Yep, I'm looking. The crazy part is I saw him over here, Uh huh. and then I saw one flare up oh, beside us. They're up there on the bar. Oh, I see them. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, man, I tell you, I, I saw these this group of fish. I made the cast. Oh, yeah. And then I saw the one about 15 feet from my face from the boat. <laughs> That's the one I, I was looking over, at. I looked over, and as soon as I looked over, this guy came up and munched it. Look at him. Look at that fish. Look how fat that fish is, dude. <laughs> I thought he was a small one at first. I know. <laughs> what a chunk. Awesome fish, Came up dude. and munched. Oh, yeah. That cow. That DOA. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Here they are. Don't make a lot of noise. Oh, okay, okay. Let me get this guy in the water, or hook up, hook up, hook up. Right here. See if they want the duck. Oh, oh, he turned on it. Oh, oh, I oh, see him. Oh, they blew out. <laughs> All right, Max, let's get him back in the water. Yes, sir. Okay, out to your left. You see this little black water right here? Yep, your yep, 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 yep. Okay, they're all facing left. Go ahead, should be instant hookup. Yep, jig it. Try to really finesse it, like rod tip up, light taps, yep. Oh, ton him right in that rod way. Rod tip up, he ate it. Wait, he tried to eat it, he ate it. Got it. Stud. Got him, baby. Dude, there's like a thousand. Yeah, boy, dude, look at all the fish in those waves. All right, I'm gonna I'm hook up too. Grab a rod, brother. Look I to your am. right. Look to your right. Swim it straight at us. Look straight here, 10 feet in front of the boat. Oh. Look at all these redfish, bro. All right, check this out. Watch this. Watch this right, right in front of the boat, right here. 10 feet. Oh, I'm a little left of them. <laughs> I love this, man. Nothing better. Keep that rod tip up so they don't hit the school. Look right go. here, Max. Look right here, Max, on the right. Oh, yeah. There's a bunch right there. Try to get a bigger one. Stick one, dude. Catch one bigger than me, bro. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna throw in the giant wad of them over here. Look, they're like 20 feet from the boat. Right over here. Right here, right here, Check too. Check this out. All right, right here, watch. I'm gonna hook up right here.
Oh, he, oh, oh, look at him coming for it. Look at him coming for it. Look at him. Eat it. Eat it. Got him, bro! <laughs> Dude! Did you see that fish just coming up and hammering it? Chasing it, bro. It's the best, dude. It's the best. <laughs> Look at them all floating in the waves right here. Ton of red fish there's, right there. There's 2,000. Two Look at them floating on the surface right back here. You see them right yeah, here? Yeah, yeah. So cool, man. It's the Ton best. <laughs> They're all big, too. Mine's ready. He's coming. Mine's He's working ready, his way back. I'm just trying to smoke these things. Let's get the fly rod out after this, all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm game for that. Or topwater, woodchuck, or duck, whatever you, whatever you want to do. I see my fish. You might see mine too, he's over there. <laughs> <laughs> Getting sporty out here, bro. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Come here, girl. There goes another one. There went another one with the boat. You mean the thousand that are right there? Yeah, there's a thousand there in the wave. <laughs> For sure, bro. Sick, man. Sometimes on this lower tide, they get on the outside of the breakers. And... Mine's right up here on the surface. He's coming in. How you doing over there, Max? I'm good. He's just giving me a workout underneath this boat. <laughs> oh, the old Osprey's singing for us today, dude. Oh, yeah. So smooth. Okay, come so on. So smooth. Come on over here. I can let you go and catch another. Ugh, ow. Good, dude? Oh, yeah. Mine's coming, mine's right here. Come on, come on. <laughs> Stud, dude. She's mad. She's oh, it's so cold in the water. Listen to her drumming. <laughs> That's a better one. <laughs> I think yours is bigger. Heck yeah. She's right here. She's right here. All right. Rule number one: is never leave your lure in the water here. That's what you'll see your rod go. Out the side of the boat, they'll just eat it. I got you. Oh. Should be ready after one or two cranks there. Here we go, here we go. She's coming, she's coming. Here she's coming. Right up to me. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> yes. yes, sir! Yes, son. All right, bro. That's a healthy one. Ma'am, did you think I forgot about you? <laughs> bro. Good ones. That right there is why I made the trip oh, yeah. from Orlando, Florida. Come hang out with you. You know, we fished together a bunch of times. Indian River Lagoon, and now our first time together here in uh, Louisiana. Oh, yeah. It's That's awesome, what it's man. About. All right, let's get these guys back in the water revived, and let's catch another one. Of course, man. Hop on. Nope, she oh. gone. She gone. She said nope. Do the honors for me. Yes, sir. We got we some, some cleanup to do here. <laughs> it's a beautiful fish, man. Yes, sir. And there's a thousand more of her cousins right there. Hi, right, buddy. See ya. Yeah, actually. Hey. hey. <laughs> <laughs> Good yeah, job, man. All right. I just can't. I mean, there's a thousand. They right haven't here. moved. There's look two, at them. All. Look at them all over there. There's two. Oh, I didn't even see that school there. Yeah, we just need to get fishing. All right, let's. Uh, yeah, let's get cleaned up and catch another couple more. <laughs> yeah, a couple, couple hundred trillion. Yes, sir. A couple hundred pounds. The Captain's Log with Captain Jonathan Moss, presented by Softwash Systems, is sponsored in part by these fine companies. Hey, I'm Captain Jonathan Moss with your Tackle Box Tip. 
And this, this is an overslot redfish. Now, something I see all the time on social media, guys, we gotta change this. We have to change our mindset. You know, we're not bass fishing. We don't wanna hang this fish, just grab him by the lip like you would a bass. With these overslot redfish, you wanna make sure you're supporting their bellies. Science studies show that hanging the redfish, think about this fish is used to being in a non-gravity location in the water. So water is holding that fish up. You know how you're in the swim pool and you're lighter, your buddies can pick you up in the, in the water? Same thing with, this, in the, with the redfish in the water. They're being supported by that water. So when you're hanging them vertically, it's going to hurt their internal organs. So when you catch a great fish, you want to get a picture for social media, a few things you got to remember. Number one, go fast. So I'm going to get this guy back in the water quickly. And number two, support that belly. These overslot redfish are our future generation, our breeder stock, and we've got to do our best to take care of them, keep them healthy. So let's get him back in the water. This is Captain Jonathan Moss with your tackle box tip. All right, I see the fish. They're all the way over there. Best part about this, no one's here. Isn't that the best part? I mean, seriously, right? Like, can't beat it. Hey, so literally don't do anything. No jigs, nothing. Just wait for the fish to get within this far of it and just reel it with the rod tip up, all right? It's gonna be a little wavy here. This is where the waves are gonna break on the bar, all right? I'm gonna do my best to get us on the far side of them, but I, these waves are... I see them. Yeah, they're there. Rod tip high. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Got him. Got him. Ooh. Oh, the wood chuck. <laughs> oh, oh, he came off. my button. He it's came okay, my button. It's okay. It's okay. Throw another out there. <laughs> they like that wood chuck. <laughs> throw another out there. They're out there. I'm going to throw two. Oh, I see you now. I see him. I see him. Oh, 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 here he wow. comes, here he comes. He's on it. <laughs> got him, got him. All right, John, I'm over you. I'm gonna try to get over you, all right? Keep reeling. I'll keep my rod tip low. <laughs> that was so sick. Ugh. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> on the wood, Chuck. Ow! Let me see if I can get one, too. Where are they at? I'm just gonna bomb it out there. Double up, Max. Double up, Max. That's a stud. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, I see him. That's what they do. They they hang out with each other sometimes. Still one underneath him? Yeah, there is. Watch this. Watch this. Get him, Max. Get him, Max. He's right beside mine. Oh, I know, I know. Hold on, hold on. He's oh. looking. Oh, he thought boat, about the it. The boat's too close. He thought about it. I see him still. The boat was too close. Come on, eat it. Bad first cast. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, they were mad at that woodchuck. <laughs> like, they were angry. That dude, that's a giant. Holy crap. Let me get down here. Oh, All right. Oh. Under the boat. Under the boat. Oh. That's a stud fish. Yeah, brother. Look at this thing. <laughs> it's a tank. Yes, sir. On the woodchuck. <laughs> that woodchuck's so mad. <laughs> He's like, I was chilling on a shelf in Dick's. <laughs> My life was good. Until and then Max came here and I, bought I, me, I just, and uh, I got nailed a by a giant redfish. Yeah, man, look at that stuff. Look at that woodchuck. 
a stud fish, dude. Dude, this is such a fat fish. Look how fat this thing is. You ever think a redfish would eat a woodchuck? No, nah, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this beautiful fish, dude. So fat. Look at the gut. <laughs> Here you go, brother. Take your fish. Got it. Got it. Oh. Look what that, a redfish, bro. <laughs> the power in that tail, the shoulders on this fish. You know, if I caught a redfish back home, any river lagoon that had shoulders this big, he would probably be another eight inches longer. Oh yeah, for I'm sure. I'm so impressed by how girthy and fat these fish are, bro. It's unreal, man, unreal. And they do get eight inches longer and fat. The, you can catch a 20 inch fish anywhere here and it could be just as fat as that's that incredible i've heard of, i have a buddy eric you know eric yeah he yeah. caught like a 24 inch fish and it weighed like 10 and a half pounds wow which is like <laughs> the tournament winner back home oh yeah a, a, a 27 inch fish back home a good one is seven and a half pounds yeah. you know back in the Look water how fat that thing is man come here girl <laughs> that's an unreal girth look at that fish come see if you talk you know, they're so cold. I know. You get them back in, it's like, they're gone. Oh, they're fine, man. I usually awesome. just throw them in head first. It gets them, gets them going Yeah, great. summertime, you can't do that when that water's hot. No. But when it's 52, 53 degree yeah. water temp, they're these, good. These redfish are so resilient, too. They're so strong. All right, homie. Let's find them and catch another. This adventure is far from over. From battling overslot red drum to doubling up in massive schools, the excitement has just begun. So stick around and see how it all unfolds on the next episode of The Captain's Log. Get him back in the war. Yes, sir. Whoa. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Man, I'm acting like I haven't been on a boat before. Got a little too much weight.